It's me! Well, what's up? I've come for the rent. You're behind several months already now. It's only a few months. I never said I'm not gonna pay you. As soon as I get the money, I'm gonna pay your rent. Uh... Well, that's fine with me. But make sure you pay. Get back! Stay here! Watch out! <laughs> Shoot! Listen, listen to me. Nothing will happen to your dad. He's gonna be all right. <laughs> Daddy! Where are the rest of them who escaped with you? Come on, tell me. Hey. Are you deaf or what? Can't you hear what I'm saying? Why don't you answer his question? We want to finish this off peacefully. I don't know where they are. Liar! <laughs> I'm telling the truth. I don't know where they are. I came for my family. You suck. You think you can cheat us with your false tears? Just a minute ago, you were shooting at us like a bad man! Come on, tell me! Why don't you come out with the truth? <laughs> now tell us, where are the rest of them? I overheard when they were talking to each other. They were saying that they're going to pass through the Panic Mountains. They're trying to get into Myanmar once they reach the border. From what he's saying, I think they're planning to pass through the temple tonight, sir.
We welcome you to our village. But can I know what brings you so far? We are here on an official business, Father. Since we have come this far, we thought of paying our respects to you. I uh, see. Shem. Yes, sir. About four to five days ago, some prisoners broke out of jail. We got an information that they came this way. And that's why we are here, Father. They are very dangerous and are also armed. They are drug dealers. Somehow, we have to get them before they go too far off. We might even kill them if necessary. Take it easy, my son. Anger only brings evil. I haven't seen these criminals. I think you have to ask the villagers. You may get some information from them. I'm sure they'll be willing to help you. Uh, a hunter. Father. Take them to the chief of this village. Yes. I guess we better get going. There's no hurry. Take some rest. You all have traveled a long way to get to this place. Better get some rest. Yes, father. I'll take leave. Bit late for a bath, isn't it? Ya yeah, Chan? God, it was you. You scared me. I thought it was a ghost. Mm -hmm. mm, you have to wait for your bosses to bathe first, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, I have to respect my seniors. Mm. Can I ask you something? This place looks mysterious. Do you know anything about it? Mm. Well, boy, why do you want to know? Nothing, really. I was just being curious. Has everyone gone to sleep yet? They were all fast asleep when I went for a bath. Please don't kill me. Please let me live. Please. Twenty years ago, there was a big group of thieves who cruelly robbed the villagers and merchants traveling around the Pyramid Mountains. These thieves were so confident of their black magic that they dared to enter into the mysterious jungle to search for an ancient treasure which was believed to have been protected by a mysterious hill tribe. It is a carved stone to size of your palm, which gives the holder some kind of magical powers. But what happened after that was that all of them disappeared in the woods. It is believed that some of them were killed by wild animals. The remaining became greedy and killed each other. Do you want to know who that robber was? He is the monk to whom you and I paid our respects to this afternoon. He was taken by the hands of the law and was a changed man when he came back. He decided to spend the rest of his life as a mom. What are you doing, father? You think you can escape from me, huh? Not so. Thinking of going back to the jungle for the treasure? The treasure is evil. It can only bring destruction. The treasure is cursed, my son. When you saw the damn light, you scrambled to take that stuff off, didn't you? 
Here's the evidence. You think you can give the stick to me on this one? Try to understand what I'm saying. You'll jeopardize many lives if you go behind the treasure. What about what you've done to my dad? Your father got what he deserved. He's sinned so much in his lifetime. But God decided his fate. Now you have a chance to change your fate. I don't believe in fate, don't you think? It's too late. Captain! Captain! Some of the villagers saw the criminals. They escaped from behind. Captain! I can lead you into the forest, sir. You're badly hurt. You cannot come with us. I can still be of some help. I told you to stay away! Captain, sir! Just listen to him, okay? It's all right. I'll ask one of the hunters to meet us. Come, let's go. Hey, 
good buddy. You seem to be strong. Mm. Mm. <laughs> hey, where is our captain? Some rest. Lasso, we need some water. Go with him, but keep an eye. Go with him. Are you all right? I'm talking to you. like dragonflies. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Dragonflies. Damn it. Get up. Let's all run. Get up. Run. Dragonflies. Dragonflies. Get up. Sir, Chan's condition looks really bad. Can we stop for a while? Chan, we'll get some rest. You'll be all right. Okay. Hey, Billy, you better take care of her. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna take care of you. This thing really hurts. Don't worry. Let's clean the wounds. Okay. Hey, don't just stand there. Come and help us.
Hey, Jack. Jack! We're on the right track. Just past the lady fruit tree jungle and we're there. Hey, did you hear a woman's voice? I'm sure that I heard it. Alan, yeah. you heard it too, right? Yeah. Hey, why didn't we stay here tonight? Yeah, he's right. <laughs> the moron! If you guys can't stay in control, you'll end up dead for sure! We have to get out of here before it gets dark. Guys, we'll stay in the cave tonight. Mark, where were you? I was looking for you all the time. Hey, Bill. Yeah? I got a feeling. This place looks very strange to me. What do you mean? I don't really feel anything. Just stop your crazy imagination. Hey, you're bringing too much. Not good for you.
Captain. Captain. Who's there? It's me, the hunter. What happened? Why is he like this? He was sucked by the fruit tree maiden, sir. Fruit tree maiden? Yeah, the ones that were chasing Mark last night, sir. Do you want me to believe the story? It's right here, can't you, you see? Just shut up! Katie. Your big mouth will get us into trouble. Can't you keep your mouth shut at least for a short while? You should learn to respect others. I want you to apologize to the captain. Hey, why aren't you saying anything? Who's there? <laughs> what do we do now? This place looks dangerous. Do you have a plan? This is a mission. We need to get them at any cost. Captain, sir! Hey! Captain! Put your guns down. Put them down! We are policemen. We are here to catch the fugitives. Are you the guys who built the fire last night? Did you see them? Yes, we did. We did see a bonfire put up not far from here. I'm Mark. What's your name? My sister's name is Sarah. Clara, shut up. What's wrong? It's nothing. I have a bad feeling. Hey. Clara, be careful. There is a fierce animal following us. Looks like they've stayed here last night. They were right under our nose. The bonfire is warm. They might not have gone far. Drop your guns.
me, son. I told you to drop your guns. I think I should be the one giving orders here. Now, so look what I got. <laughs> I think you should put your guns down. Keep them there. Nasso, what do you want to do with them? I want everyone dead. Hey, but I want to have some fun. It's up to you. Hey, come here! Take your hands off my daughter! Captain! Captain, sir! Captain! Captain, sir! Help my daughter! Help! Leave me! Captain, sir! Help my daughter! Please! Just kill them all! <laughs> now so, what are we gonna do now? If you ask me again, I'm gonna kick your ass! Oh! 
You badly need some rest. Slowly. <laughs> Grandpa! Katie! Are you alright? Thanks for saving my life. your life if you follow him. <laughs> you're very lucky that you're alive. The silver scale is very poisonous and nobody has survived its attack. Silver scale? It's a giant serpent. They say it is a demon. That's not true. Thanks for all that you have done for us. We'd have been in real trouble without you. You're making a mistake by trusting them. Would you shut up or I'm going to kick you? Have you ever heard about the Karen's tale? The mysterious people who hide themselves in the jungle. Listen, I don't want suggestions from you. I know what I have to do and I'm just... Why? I've killed a lot of people too. You don't know about him. He's dangerous. He's the one who killed the monk in the temple. Did you say something? Don't, sir. Another word and you're dead. Don't, sir. <laughs> we don't have the rights. These guys surely deserve to die. When all of this is over, I'm going to have the both of you together. <laughs> what? Hey, 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 what are you doing? Oh, hey, 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 you hey, 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 we look for herbs in the forest. That's not true. I know that this jungle is cursed. And only demons can wander around without any fear. Hey, they are trying to help us. It's time we need to trust others. No, I won't trust anyone. Would you stop being pessimistic? They're also humans just like us. Hey, Clara, calm down. That's enough. Grandpa, are you okay? <sighs> I have to find more herbs. The herbs which I have given now does not work for a very long time. I need to find some strong herbs so that you reach my village. Where is that? It's nearby. You stay here and watch them. We'll go and get the herbs.
Come, Clara. They are the only support we have got. They live in this forest and they know about these herbs. You shouldn't be fighting with them. I know about herbs too. Here they are. At you and talks to you, I feel he loves you. Clara, stay right there. Whatever happens here, promise that you'll take them right to the village. I hope you understand this. There's no more time. Hey, go!
Uh, feel thirsty. Captain! Captain, sir! C Are you all right? Thank hmm? God that you're all right. I wouldn't have been able to forgive myself for the wife. Don't worry. I can deal with the situations. I've given a word to the Father that I'll protect you and be with you always. Thanks. But I'm in no danger, okay? Uh, 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 oh. So? What's up now? Why do you look so dull? Because I'm damn thirsty. Come, Grandpa. How are you now? Yeah, I feel better. Mm. You guys are damn thick-skinned. No, sir. We have a lot to settle after this. Clara, I don't think we can take these guys to the village. Why is that? Quiet. Someone might hear us. I'm planning to take them to the border. But it's nearly full moon. And if we don't take them to the village, Grandma will be upset with us. Sarah. You're here. Let's go home. Clara told me that you have traveled very far. Yeah. We are from the city and we were following the criminals. Okay. I'll ask the villagers to take care of your needs. You can take bath, change, and take your food. It's all right. We need to leave. We don't want to trouble you. It's all right with us. Isn't it, Grandma? Sarah, take care of them. Yes. Go. Hey! Hey! Be gentle, What are you man. doing? Go Go on, get your hands off me. Sit up. Hey! You can't treat us like this. We're not your slaves. You open your mouth again, and you're dead. Hmm? No. 
Why didn't you just shoot me? Hey! Why didn't you just kill Take me, your hand off me? What are you holding a gun for? Just shoot me, damn it! Shoot me! Take your freaking hands off me! Hey! Give it back, it's mine! Father's coin, sir. I'm sure you've heard about the legend of the Karen's magic coin, haven't you, sir? Yeah. My dad used to talk about this. Do you believe in all this? Well, Hunter, do you know anything about this? I don't know, sir. But I think Katie might know. Oh, where's Katie? Remove the bodies around. This place needs to be cleared. Grandma, I see a difference in Sarah. Maybe it's because of the captain. That's nonsense. Sarah knows well enough. The humans make us think like this. I know you love her, but you have to wait for the right time. If she betrays you for the human, you very well know what to do with her. Let's wait and see. For now, clear this place. Don't put your head down. We have a lot of things to do. I got something for you to handle. <gasps> Hi, baby. It's Katie's book. What are you talking about? The one with the... The father had given it to her. It's really special to her. Not now, Hunter. We are in the middle of the summary. Please come with me. I'm going after them. What's wrong, Sarah? You guys must leave this place as early as possible. To where? I don't understand.
I should have told you this long back. After the time travel point was taken, our village was cursed. The animals in this village became abnormal. Strange things started happening. And on every full moon, we become different from others, we change. What change? I don't get what you're saying, sir. Sarah. If you help me, I'll give you something special. Getting up, Dazzle! Let's get out of here!
the father's coin, so... In the middle of the village, there's a mark for the coin. Whoever turns it anti-clockwise will be able to travel to any time in history. Don't worry, I'll get you out of here. All this time they've guarded it so that nobody can use it to travel back in time. You can use the coin and destroy them. Come on, get me, damn it! Come on! You got the coin? Huh. I'll travel in time and undo all this madness. That's absolutely useless. Nobody can change whatever has happened. Listen to me. Leave the coin and go. But it has to be changed. Don't do that. I can never forget the time we had.
I did all the best I could. But I could not save you, sir. I'm sorry. 